Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So I'm here with my Bathing Garden Circus Collection um, haul. This is from the Circus Collection restock, of course. I didn't purchase much from this because a lot of it seemed like um, heavy bakery to me and I don't need to let you guys know that I don't like heavy bakery scents, right? Okay. Um, from the collection that she posted recently, I also didn't purchase anything because I'm to the point that I have more wax than I know what to do with it. So it's kind of a obsession and it's kind of getting out of hand. So we're slowing it down, slowing it down. So I got two samples. The first one is the Hall of Mirrors and it's one of those big, big bunt cakes. And I'm not going to take it out because it's very, very crumbly right now. So to me, I don't have the scent description of these. To me, this smells like maybe a white cake with cotton candy or maybe like a tres leches with cotton candy. It's definitely a sweet, sweet scent, like very, very sugary sweet. So I actually like it. Um, it's not a scent that I would go out of my way to purchase it. I probably will melt this in Isabella's room because she likes these sugary sweet candy scents. But thank you so much for the sample. The next one is a tiny little bunt in toasted sugar. I was going to say boasted sugar. The heck. This one I'll take it out because it's not so messy. And it's adorable, so I want you guys to see it. Look at how cute. So cute. Um, definitely a toasted sugar type of scent. I almost get maybe a coffee like a, a milk and coffee scent mixed with this toasted sugar. I don't know. It's 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 a really good scent. I actually like it, and I actually will melt it, which is totally out of my comfort zone. This scent, but I like it. So surprise, surprise! I did purchase the peppermint bubbles one. Who would have thought, huh, that I would purchase a peppermint scent? And this is just a white tart with pink and green glitter. And a leaf, a mint leaf. This is good. Uh, it's nothing very complex or or very interesting, to be honest to you. This is more of like a peppermint marshmallow. I like it. I will enjoy it. But it's not a pe it's not a clamshell that I'm gonna say I have to go out of my way to find it. You know, it smells to me just like any other uh, peppermint marshmallow. Okay, moving on. Golden trapeze. This is very beautiful. It's a very beautiful tart. It's so dark in here. I apologize. If I open the windows back there, then it gets so, like, the glare is too much. But this is so pretty. It's a white, not white, a yellow, creamy yellow color with chunks of gold. It's very pretty, hopefully. Like, those are actually, they look like, um, oh my god, like if you were a miner and you get those chunks of gold, I forgot what they're called, nuggets, gold nuggets. And then you have the, the drama phase, drama phase. This is really good. Oh my god, I wish I had scent descriptions to tell you guys what these are. It's broken. This is a fresh scent. I don't know if this is um, something with lemongrass, maybe? Do I detect? I Maybe I detect. I hate not having scent description. But maybe I detect a hint of an aff effervescent scent. Effervescent scent? Effervescent. There's definitely lemon. This is a fresh, clean scent. So I really, really like this one. Really do. Kind of sucks that they don't have the Facebook group anymore because that's where I used to go to get the scent description. Now it's kind of hard. Freak Show. I had no idea I had ordered this one. This was one of the samples that I got. And I don't know why I ordered it because I wasn't a big fan of the sample. Maybe it was a mistake on my part, not hers. This one is Bakery Nutty. I don't know. But 
I will melt it. You know, it's not terrible. It's just not my, my favorite. Blushing Lemonade. This smells really good. That's what that looks like. A little slice of grapefruit, it looks like it to me. This has an effervescent note, but it's very light. It's not strong. Um, smells like a lemonade. Sorry, I'm not being like a, the biggest help today, but the bathing garden scents are always hard to describe because they're never like simple. They're always very complex. A lot of stuff makes in them, which I do love, and that's why I'm a big fan of hers. But it makes not having the scent description very hard because you always have so many different notes. It's hard to tell you guys what this smells like, you know? So I just get like a nice, refreshing, cooling lemonade type of scent. Now, I don't know what type of citruses are in here, but it smells really good. I got two of these. I thought I would love the scent. Um, it's a little unique. Um, it's the menagerie. Is it menagerie? The menagerie. Okay, so I got two of them. And this is the one that sounded like it was more up my alley because it gets like to smells like garden herbs there must have been something with the mint in here so it's just a pretty green color herb green with some herbs in there i like it i like it i think at first i wasn't a huge fan of it because i was expecting a different scent i don't know what the heck i was expecting but this is very herb garden like Like a lot of spices, but herb spices, like herb cooking spices. So my husband's gonna love this. He loves cooking with fresh herbs and, you know, he just loves the smell of like cilantro and all that other stuff. Rosemary, thyme, so it's good. I think I expected a little more of a spa-like scent and this to me is more of like a kitchen scent. A unique kitchen set almost like Tuscan herb from Bath and Body Works dancing elephants which I totally got this one because of the name I'm not even gonna lie I love elephants so there's a raspberry in here for sure I don't know what else is in here but there's raspberry and I really like it it's a tart raspberry scent Last but not least, and my most favorite when it comes to beauty, this is the Ringmaster's Paramore. Someone's blowing up my phone. Mmm, it smells good. Look at how beautiful, beautiful this tart is with that Victorian looking, um, antique looking mirror. You know, it's just absolutely beautiful. And what is in here? No idea, but I really like this scent. There's a sweetness to it, but it's also very... It's like... just One of my favorite scents from the bathing garden is Marie Antoinette Boudoir. Because it smells so... Um, what is the word that I'm thinking? Um, sophisticated and chic and just classic. And this reminds me, not of that scent, but I have the same feeling when I smell this. Like it belongs in a place, like, uh, um, of a high society type of place. Like if I'm going to someone's house and they're, you know, I don't know what I'm trying to explain. You guys know what I'm trying to explain? It just smells like high-end So I, I love it. Look at her dancing in the back. Alright, but anyways, you guys, I know this video probably was not the most exciting. Um, I'm, I don't know. I, I'm still making the videos because I got to put these things out there, but I'm not feeling it right now. And it's probably just because I've been going through a lot of stuff. But hopefully I'll start feeling more like myself soon. But anyways... 
I do have another haul video coming up soon and I'm really excited about this one. So maybe I'll be a little more like, ah. But anyways, I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching and see you soon. Bye.